Helping you live healthy, a new study shows high blood pressure in pregnant women has increased by 6% each year for several years. Researchers studied CDC records on more than 150 million women between the ages of 15 and 49 who gave birth in hospitals in the past four decades. And the study suggests that this increase in high blood pressure could be connected to the rise in women waiting to have children. Joining me now to discuss this new report is Dr. Shari Kalaker. She is an Ascension St. Vincent's primary care physician. Good morning, doctor. Good Thank morning. you for being here. Thank you for having me. And congratulations me. to you. I know you're expecting you. as well. Yes. All right, so, so you understand exactly what the risks are associated with high blood pressure when it comes to pregnancy, but it's interesting because you're a primary care physician, yes. you're actually seeing this trend in high blood pressure among women even before they get pregnant. Absolutely. Um, you know, just as we were discussing before, pregnant people are people too, and the trend of, of obesity and chronic heart disease um, has trended upwards over the last couple of years too, so we can only expect it to, to see it in our pregnant women as well. Um, so that's why it's so important to make sure that you are evaluated at least once a year. Um, to kind of have a baseline of your health so that w when you do become pregnant, if that is your choice, um, that you're, you kind of have an idea of what's going on with your body before everything starts to change and get crazy. Well, because <laughs> while, while high blood pressure can be managed when you're not pregnant, certainly with medication, Correct. you know, the reality is, is that having a little baby growing inside of you can complicate things if you have li bl high blood pressure. Yes. Um, as a pregnant woman, let's talk a little bit about the dangers to the woman, and then we'll talk a little bit about the dangers to the fetus mm -hmm. when, when a woman has high pr blood pressure and is expecting. Okay. So um, in women, we can expect to see see, um, again, pretty much the same things that we would see in non-pregnant women. Um, so um, heart attacks, strokes, um, even death. The big thing that we worry about is preeclampsia, um, which is high blood pressure with in-organ damage um, that can lead to seizures, uh, which can be very dangerous um, for you and the baby. Um, as far as the fetus is concerned, it can uh, stunt fetal growth. So that's definitely not something that you want. You don't want your child to start off um, lacking nutrition because you're not getting enough blood to the fetus. Um, can also cause preterm, preterm delivery in, in the fetus. Um, and that's, that's yeah. pretty much oh, it. That's, that's, mm -hmm. that's enough. A lot. Yes. <laughs> so, it's scary enough. Yeah, it certainly is mm -hmm. um, because you want to do the best that you can for your baby. Mm -hmm. And the reality is, is you have to be healthy in order to, to provide, you know, the best environment for your child. Exactly. Um, that said, is there something that you were seeing? I know we mentioned that women are waiting later and maybe their blood pressure has gone uncontrolled and it's higher to, before they have children. Mm -hmm. Or is this just simply, uh, you know, eating too much salt? Is, I mean, are there are certain factors here that's causing the high blood pressure? Um, I think it's a combination of both actually. Um, as you know, when we get older, our bodies just don't respond to things the same as they used to when we were younger. So just getting older in general um, increases your risk for having um, those, those complications. Um, and then the explosion of processed foods and fast food restaurants and just access to those things or lack of access um, to healthy foods has really contributed to um, the increase in hypertension that we've been seeing with the pregnant women. So are there a lot of women who have high blood pressure, maybe it's genetic in a way, and they become pregnant? Are there, are there safe medications that they can take then during their pregnancy that won't impact the baby? Yes, absolutely. And um, if, you are, if you're on blood pressure medication before you get pregnant, you want to make sure that you're, again, seeing either your OBGYN or your primary care because some of those medications you cannot take while you're pregnant. Really good. Um, so you want to make sure that you talk to your physician, let them know. Um, maybe you're not necessarily planning, but it could happen. Those are things that you want to be aware of. And it's just important to have that conversation anyway so that you're taking good care of your exactly. body before you have the baby. Exactly. So you don't have to make these dramatic changes <laughs> once you're pregnant. Doctor, thank you for being here. Yes, do appreciate you so it. And good luck with you me. with thank the baby. You. Congratulations you. again.